Alrighty guys, I'm back on another adventure. <coughs> this time I got a little of a longer hike than I normally do. Uh, I am hiking to an alpine lake. Very high up in the mountains. The time is barely past 7 o'clock. I left about 5 o'clock this morning. But uh, getting an early start because I got a long hike ahead of me. I'm on vacation, by the way, so that's why I'm doing this be here for four days so I am uh, at my first rest stop this area uh, the history behind it as you can tell it was a wildfire that broke out in 2003 uh, as you can tell, you can see how Mother Nature recovered, is recovering from it over the years. It's remarkable that one little lonely tree is still standing after the fire. You know, it is really great out here. Uh, I, I love it. The beauty of nature is just remarkable. Words cannot describe what it is like. Well, after walking through about two miles of burn or a forest fire happened in the past, finally back in the trees. That means I got to go through the trees. I got one more section where a fire happened, and then I'll be at the lake. This hike has been really killer. I'm standing about 10,000 feet right now. And I got about a thousand feet more to go. Uh, it's been a, it's been a great hike. I'm enjoying it. It's really hot out. Yeah, it's been rough, but hard work pays off. All right, <laughs> so this is what I've been dodging. Oh, the whole time. It is now 10.38. I'm still not at the lake. Uh, the trail is on the other side of this. But this has been happening constantly. So, uh, it's very tiring. It's wearing me out. I'm only at 10,572 feet. Still got about 600 more feet to gain from there. 
Sorry about that, there, Sam. Hello, hello, hello. Well, I am back. And as you can tell, I made it to camp. No, I didn't make it to the lake. And cloud chains. <laughs> the trail was pretty much just covered with fallen trees, like after four and a half miles. And me carrying all of that on an 80 pound back. Yeah. Climbing over a whole bunch of trees over and over and going extremely uphill became extremely hard. I had to make a decision. And I went with my plan B option. That was if, if things didn't work out, I couldn't make it to the lake. And then it was turn around and go back down to the bottom and set up camp. So that's exactly what I'm doing. Really nice, I like it. Sun's gone. As my Red Cross radio. Yep. It's also an NO, NOAA weather radio. Uh, I could charge my phone on it. Doesn't really do so well in the charging process. But. And it's got a flashlight built in it, but that's about it. And I'm trying to set up camp. It's going to be extremely slow. i got to go down and filter more water sometime. But for now, I found my place at home. Well, this is all. See you later, people. All right, so... Back at camp, got my radio out, I listen to some music, my tent's all set up, but not all my sleeping stuff. I, I, I said it was going to take a while to do camp, well I kind of lied about that, <laughs> kind of just went ahead and did it all anyways. See, I got my shelter, I got my drying rack, I got my trash, I even provide you with the table. And I just got done filtering water. It's my REI Trail 25 liter backpack. Really good design, I like it. Got it for 10 bucks. Unbelievable, right? So I'm here in my camp. The time is 5.16. And it's getting later, but I don't care. Uh, I'm going to relax and can't have a fire, so I'm kind of screwed about that. It's really beautiful out here though. I love it. Alright, so lesson today. Building a shelter. Second shelter. For you to sit. In case it rains. But yeah. Took my trekking poles. Some nylon cord. Some bungee cords over there. I don't know. Seems a uh, hold up. I like to see how it holds up when it starts raining. Yep, this is home for me for the next four days.
Filtering water ain't easy. It's like milking a cow. Mm -hmm. Yep, we just ain't uh, easy being cheesy. So it's nice. I'm out here pretty much alone. Uh, I'm down with the stream, filtering some water for tonight. Uh, it's really nice. I like the tan. It's pretty sweet. Uh, tomorrow I'm going to try and get my muscles back, try to relax a little. Can't have a fire, so it kind of sucks. Sounds like thunder's coming. Yeah, fishing it is out. Maybe water's clean. Trying to pick up, <laughs> and the clouds are coming. It's getting really dark. Looking pretty intense. It's 6:35. And the wind's starting to pick up. 
Oh, but I got this wall built. I got shelter. No, uh, because of the clouds, I moved everything in here. And what had happened? That was an experiment. Yeah, this has been a <laughs> starting to an epic trip. I can't wait to finish and do more. Alright, so you wanna see? Look at the clouds. Well now they're kinda of glaring up, but they keep coming and going. All right, well, there you have it. It is getting dark. I started a fire. Well, I met my neighbor. Yeah, we were talking about it, and now we both got lost earlier. Yeah, pretty crazy stuff. But I know we're not supposed to have a fire, but I beg a small one. Won't well, hurt. See that? I only chopped one log. Something small.